What's up, eggheads? Kenan here with New Egg Now, always bringing you the best products for the best prices. If you're rummaging around the internet for a universal docking station that supports dual displays, please look no further. The solution to all of your problems, right here. The Wavelink USB-C Ultra 5K Universal Docking Station. That's right, I said 5K. Let's open the box. Okay, so this is everything you get in the box. You get a quick start guide, information cards. Okay, one DC 20 volt certified power adapter. One USB-A to C cable. One USB-C to C cable. <laughs> and the USB-C Ultra 5K universal docking station itself. All right, it is fully compatible with USB Type-C, Type-A, and Thunderbolt 3 laptops and desktops. That means it is fit for the future. This is the latest technology. That means you're gonna get more mileage for your money. All right, that's always very important. A lot of universal hubs out there aren't so universal anymore. All right, some only support up to USB 3.0. This is compatible on computers with USB-C and Thunderbolt 3, all right? They've included the USB-C and USB-A to C cables. So let's take a closer look here. Nice compact design. It's gonna look pretty professional on your desk. All right, on the front you'll see four super speed USB 3.0 ports, getting you up to five gigabits per second transfer speed, as well as headphone and mic jacks. Really maximize the performance capability of your machine. Of course, these ports are still backwards compatible with USB 2.0 and 1.1 devices and you're good to go with, with hot swapping. Almost said hot swapping. Good to go with hot swapping. So plug in your keyboard, mouse, optical drive, USB, foot massager, you name it, unplug and plug back in at will, no problem. On the back, two more super speed USB 3.0 ports. That means six USB 3.0 ports in total. One USB-C in port. You got your gigabit ethernet jack right here and some display ports, all right? Let's talk about the display. This supports up to 5K display. Output up to 5120 by 2880 at 60 hertz. How about that? How do we get the 5K, you ask? Well, they uh, have it broken down here on a little diagram. All right, so when you use the dual display ports, you have two uh, dual display ports. If you use them simultaneously, with a 5K monitor, that's how you're gonna get the 5K. All right, the Wavelink Ultra 5K docking station also supports dual 4K display. You can achieve this in three different ways. You can use two 4K HDMI video, or two 4K display ports, or one of each. You could use one 4K HDMI and one 4K display port. 4K output will be up to 4096 by 2160, at 60 hertz. And again, you get the 5K by using both display ports simultaneously. Wavelink offers you a lot of flexibility with this device. It supports USB to display. You get distinct mode, extended mode, mirrored mode, primary display, obviously. You can extend left, right, above or below, or rotate 90, 180, or 270 degrees. So this is gonna accommodate anyone who has two monitors literally for any reason. Gaming, architecture, doctor's office, stock market, day traders, all right? You're all gonna love this. And compatibility is very wide ranging. You can use this with any Windows XP 7, 8, or 10 machine. You can also use this with Mac OS 10.6 and onwards. Mac OS 10.13.4 to 10.13.6 has single extended display support with AirPlay. No support on Linux or Unix uh, or ARM-based Windows operating systems like Surface RT, for example. Uh, also, the docking station does not support power delivery function, all right? But you will get to use up to six USB 3.0 devices simultaneously, all good for hot swapping. You got your ethernet connection, headphone and mic jack. You'll get either dual 4K display or a single 5K display. You get multiple viewing modes, distinct, extended, mirrored, etc. My dear eggheads, the Wavelink Ultra 5K Universal Docking Station. 
Please let us know what you think of this product in the reviews and comments. For current pricing, please check the description or click that link below. I'm Kenan with Newegg Now, and now you know. Hi guys, Greg here for Newegg. As laptops get thinner and lighter, which is a good thing, we find that in order to save size and weight, their connectivity ports have started to become fewer and further between, which we might take as a sort of bad thing. However, the saving grace is an amazingly powerful connection type either called USB-C or Thunderbolt 3. By utilizing either of these two types of connector ports on a laptop, you can cover almost every input and output that you could possibly need, including two-way power. Now to an old guy like me who grew up with a computer that had a plethora of ports all over it, including parallel and serial ports that had super wide ribbon cables coming out all over the place and creating a big mess everywhere, this is just like a daydream. Imagine, come home, plunk your lovely little laptop down on your work desk, plug in only one very thin cable and then voila! Absolutely all of your peripherals are connected now, including the power supply to the laptop. So what do you then need to pull off this feat of magic, aside from having one of these super ports on your laptop? Well, you just need this beautiful little wavelength docking station. Then we have two USB Type-C ports for USB-C peripheral connectivity and 3 amp of 5 volt power. They're right over here. We then have, over here, we have a gigabit Ethernet port and we have uh, two audio out, mic in, and then two HDMI and two DisplayPort connections. What else could you possibly need? It's basically all there. As the Wavelength docking station is equipped with DisplayLink technology, you get super simple plug and play connectivity for a series of monitors. Up to two 4K displays or one 5K. The HDMI ports and the display ports support 4K with resolutions up to 4096 by 2160 at 60 Hz. Or when using dual display ports simultaneously, the dock supports one 5K monitor up to a resolution of 5120 by 2880 at 60 Hz. So whether you're working on a CAD project at home, cutting videos, or just playing some fun games, you're totally covered here. One of the coolest features is that if your laptop supports Type-C charging, this dock will then be able to charge your laptop with up to a 60 watt power requirement right through that one little USB cable you've plugged into the dock. So there's no need to hook up a power cable to the laptop anymore. The one power supply to the dock will handle everything. And aside from giving your laptop 60 watts of power, it also leaves another 40 watts of power for all downstream devices connected to the dock because the dock's own power supply, which is here, provides the dock with a hefty 100 watts of power. Wow, that's pretty nice. As a little note, for those laptops that don't have a USB-C or Thunderbolt 3 connector, but do have a USB-A port, we got it right here, this one, okay? Don't worry, Wavelink has got you covered by including a USB-C to USB-A cable in the package. So you can still use this powerful dock for everything and the features related to transferring data. And you're only going to be missing the ability to charge your laptop via the dock's own power supply and will just need to use your laptop's original charger. The dock supports, of course, both Windows and Mac systems, including Windows 10, 8, 7, and Mac iOS 10.15. We've noticed too that this lovely design little box has very sticky silicone feet. So once you set it down on the table or your desk, it's gonna be planted nicely and securely and not slide around all over the place, which is a great feature considering how many cables you just may have plugged into the dock. You definitely don't want it flying around all over the place. And there you have it. That's a wrap for me, Big G on Newegg, signing off. What's up, Eggheads? Kenan here with Newegg Now, always bringing you the best products for the best prices. Does your outdoor wireless network kinda stink? Dead spots? Short range? Has rain, snow, or extreme heat destroyed your router? 
If you need a way to expand your outdoor network, either for your business offices or for your home or both, you're in the right place. I've got the Wavelink Outdoor Wi-Fi Extender. Let's get it out of the box and take a look. Okay, here's everything in the box. A power cord, PoE converter, RJ45 cable, some screws, two zip ties, got a quick start guide, warranty card, four antennas that I've already attached to the main course, the outdoor Wi-Fi extender. Okay, really solid construction, and I mean really solid construction. This industry-leading hardware ensures that the extender can be deployed in a wide variety of environments, withstanding broad ranges of humidity and temperature. That's going to be minus 22 Fahrenheit to 158 Fahrenheit. That's crazy. It'll withstand harsh outdoor climates. It's IP65 rated. That's for weatherproof housing components that can endure extreme cold, heat, or continuous moisture. Really robust hardware. All right. So we know it'll survive, but what'll it do for us? The Wavelink Outdoor Wi-Fi Extender is designed for WISP CPE solutions and long distance wireless network solutions. This Wi-Fi extender features up to 1000 milliwatts of wireless transmission power and has a built-in 4x7 DBI detachable omnidirectional antenna. All right, this provides an efficient way to pick up and maintain a stable signal for hundreds of yards of wireless network connection. Independent high power amplifiers make for significantly increased power output up to five times transmission power. This is going to enhance existing Wi-Fi coverage, allow you to get that Wi-Fi anywhere, eliminate those annoying dead zones. All right. And while this is working, the LNA, the low noise amplifier, is designed to minimize additional noise and increase the power of the signal. All of that sounds great, but I just want high speed internet. What speeds do I get? Okay, super fast wireless performance. You've got MT7620A plus 7612E dual MTK chips to ensure stable performance. It has 802.11ac tech. The extender operates on both 2.4 gigahertz and 5 gigahertz simultaneously. That's 150 megabits per second and 860 megabits per second, respectively, meaning up to 1200 megabits per second. Different devices can connect simultaneously across dual bands, making this the ideal scenario for streaming HD videos, online gaming, or other simultaneous bandwidth intensive tasks. With the high power amplification and the four omnidirectional antennas with dual frequency bands, internet is just everywhere in the open air. You're insured to access the internet when you're walking around the home, if you've got a cafe outside your business, or if your school or university uh, wants to extend coverage around a soccer field, football field, etc. It's really easy to install even in those types of large outdoor areas because this one has integrated power over internet support. You can install this in areas where power outlets aren't readily available. That's so nice. And depending on your needs, depending on the complexity of your mission, you can switch between four different modes, AP mode, router mode, repeater mode, and WISP mode. AP mode, or access point, is going to convert a wired network to a wireless network, which allows you to connect laptops, tablets, phones, or other Wi-Fi devices. Router mode creates an instant private wireless network and shares internet to multiple Wi-Fi devices. Repeater mode extends Wi-Fi coverage of an existing wireless network. And finally, WISP mode transmits Wi-Fi from one point to another point. And that's pretty much it, everyone. It's going to be very easy to install. I mean, it's designed to be an effective solution for outdoor wireless networking. So yeah, they've made it simple to use. With its centralized management platform and high degree of flexibility, it's the ideal choice for providing point-to-point, point-to-multipoint, and outdoor Wi-Fi coverage. You'll attach the external antennas like so. You'll find some fixed pole and any other similar object outside. You'll thread the zip ties through these holes here. All right, thread the zip ties through the holes like so. Okay, and then you'll just wrap the whole kit around the object to which you want to attach the extender. 
All right, then using the PoE converter and power adapter, you can turn it on. There's a very clear set of instructions in the quick start guide to get you connected, no problem. And with all of that, you'll have high powered, long distance, omnidirectional, dual band coverage up to 1200 megabits per second with an extreme weatherproof unit. All right, get your whole family connected outside and around the house with ease, stream movies by the pool, keep all your guests at the restaurant happy and connected outdoors. The possibilities are almost endless with the Wavelink Outdoor Wi-Fi Extender. For current prices, please check the description or click the link below. I'm Kenan with Newegg Now, and now you know. Welcome back to Newegg Now. I'm your host, Liz. Today, we're going to be looking at an excellent gaming chair that even hides a few features. This is the Downex Massage Gaming Chair. One of the first things you're going to immediately notice is the ergonomic design language. The Downex Gaming Chair has a high back and a hidden footrest. When they are used together, they can help relieve tension in your back. The winged back provides multi-point body contact to help distribute pressure and alleviate pain in your spine and lumbar region. The Downex also has a full recliner mode, which can take anywhere from between a firm 90 degrees all the way down to 170 degrees. So, it is an excellent option for taking a quick power nap. To help you relax even more, we have the second standout feature of the Downex massage chair. Let me show you. Do you hear that? That's a beauty right there. By plugging in this cable, the chair will automatically start to massage your back. The plug itself is a simple USB-A, which means you can plug it into a battery bank, the wall, or even your computer directly. Moving on to take a quick look at the design here, you'll immediately notice the chair is covered in this high quality hand-sewn PU leather. That leather is there to cover the six inch high density foam that sits atop its alloy frame. You can easily personalize your support for your elbows, your wrists, with the all new Actin chair armrests, updated with a metal internal mechanism for that classic long lasting durability. That's right there, guys. The Downex massage chair also features a class three heavy duty KGS gas piston. It's great for consistency, durability, and safety. It has a maximum rated capacity of 350 pounds. The seat itself is 21 inches width by 24 inches depth with a backrest that is 36 inches in height and 23 inches in width and with an adjustable height of 3.5 inches. There you have it, eggheads a durable, reliable, and stylish looking gaming chair that comes with all the bells and whistles you could possibly ask for with some added luxuries on top of that. This will make an easy addition to any office or gaming setup. This has been Liz with Newegg Now. Make sure to stick around to discover all sorts of cool new products. What's up eggheads, Kenan here with Newegg Now, always bringing you the best products for the sweetest, sweetest prices. If you're looking for a way to upgrade your Wi-Fi experience, if you're tired of dealing with Ethernet cables, and if you're on Windows 10 64-bit, look no further. I've got the one, the only, Fenvi FVAX3000R Wi-Fi 6 PCIe wireless adapter here. I value your time, so let's just get right to it and open the box. Okay, here we are. Everything you get in the box. An instruction manual. A cute little CD with drivers. That's really nice. A low profile bracket for small form factor builds. Included in the little baggie is a Bluetooth cable. You get two high gain antennas. Check it out, we got the two high gain antennas right here. And of course, the FVAX3000R 
Wi-Fi 6 wireless adapter. By default, the AX3000R is attached to the standard profile bracket, as you can see. But again, just to remind you, they do include the small form factor bracket if you need it, all right? Also notice the large, handsome heatsink that's already on the chip, ready to operate at full performance without overheating or throttling. Thank you, Fenvi. That's a very good thing. It'll distribute heat away from the core components and stay cool even if you're doing those large intensive file transfers over your network or if you're gaming or streaming high-res movie files or whatever. The chipset underneath the heatsink is the Intel AX200 chipset, which allows this Wi-Fi adapter to operate on 5 gigahertz and 2.4 gigahertz dual band, all right? And that gives you wireless speeds up to 2400 megabits per second at the 5 gigahertz band and 574 megabits per second at the 2.4 gigahertz band. Of course, your router still needs to support Wi-Fi 6, okay? Check your router, please. I don't wanna be blamed for a bad router. All right, as I alluded to before with that included Bluetooth cable, the AX3000R also supports Bluetooth 5.0, easily pairs with Bluetooth keyboards, mice, and other peripherals. If that wasn't enough, you also get two by two MUMIMO, M-U-M-I-M-O, that's multiple user, multiple input, and multiple output. It also supports OFDMA. That's obviously orthogonal frequency division multiple access. This is perhaps the most important feature of Wi-Fi 6. It basically allows for multiple users with various bandwidths to be served simultaneously. In the traditional approach, unique users compete to upload data, but in Wi-Fi 6, 802.11ax schedules the users to avoid clashes. That's just awesome. Also included, of course, are the two high gain antennas ensuring greater Wi-Fi coverage, enhanced stability, further ensuring a smooth internet experience. I speed tested this with the antennas installed and this was actually the second FEMV adapter with which I achieved a speed slightly greater than with an ethernet cord plugged directly into my NIC. That's just crazy. And lastly, talking about compatibility, I sort of hinted at it before, this will only work with Windows 10 64-bit, okay? I'm sorry if you're on another operating system, it just won't work. But if you are on Windows 10 64-bit, whether you're on a mid-tower, full-tower, or mini-tower computer with the low profile and full height bracket provided, this will fit your PCIe slots. It'll fit PCIe slots from X1 to X16 lanes, suitable for almost all PCs. And with that, you'll get that 2.4 gigahertz and five gigahertz dual band frequency, less lag, greater coverage with the high gain antennas, the Wi-Fi 6 features of MUMIMO and that orthogonal frequency division multiple access, the Bluetooth 5.0. I mean, it's just a great, Wi-Fi upgrade for your desktop. Instant 802.11ax, what more can I say? My dear eggheads, the Fenvi FV-AX3000R Wi-Fi 6 PCIe wireless adapter. For specific prices, please check the description or click that link below. Let me know down in the reviews or comments just how much your Wi-Fi experience improves with this adapter. I'm Kenan with Newegg Now, and now you know. What's up, Eggheads? Kenan here with Newegg Now, always bringing you the best products for the best prices. If you've got a dual monitor setup, this video is for you. If you've got a dual monitor setup and you're tired of all the space it takes up on your desk, this video is definitely for you. We're taking a look at the almighty Huanuo dual arm monitor stand. All right, and I already have it all set up right here. Before I speak any further, let's get compatibility out of the way. All right, the Huanuo dual arm monitor stand is a pretty universal mount. It's gonna fit two 13 to 27 inch monitors with VESA mounting patterns of 75 by 75 millimeter or 100 by 100 millimeter. It'll securely hold two monitors, each weighing between 4.4 to 14.3 pounds. All right, check your specs. The monitor stand will not work on glass or particle board tables, all right? So if you're on a glass or particle board table, you'll just have to buy a new table along with the Huanua dual monitor stand. 
The monitor stand can be fixed via C-clamp, all right, fitting desks with a thickness up to 3.26 inches, and it can also be mounted through a grommet mounting hole in the desk. The grommet mounting fits desks with thickness up to 3.4 inches, all right? So you mount the stand according to your needs. Just check the specs of your monitors and tables. So if your monitors and tables are a good match, Let's keep exploring this fine product. All right, so this is very cool. The dual monitor stand works via gas spring. It comes with two gas spring arms that you can easily adjust to get a better posture, relieving strain on your neck, back, and shoulders. Both arms are directly mounted onto the desk, creating greater stability, and adjusting one arm will not move or affect the other arm, meaning adjusting one monitor will not move or affect the other monitor. See, I can move or adjust my left monitor, the right one stays in place, or if I need to adjust the right one, the left one stays in place. Very, very convenient. And just look how much space I freed up from my desk. So instead of putting two monitors directly onto your desktop, this dual monitor stand holds both monitors above the desk at eye level with adjustable arms. You also get full range of motion adjustment. All right, so these dual arms can both be swiveled 360 degrees and the Vesa plates rotate 360 degrees, swivel 180 degrees and tilt from plus 45 to plus 90. Check this out. Okay, so adjusting to 45, back up to 90. I can move this around. I can have a monitor like this. I can continue to move it around. Okay, so a full 360 degree rotation. I'm gonna bring that back, check this out. So, you know, it, this is just an added bonus. All right, you can place both monitors in portrait or landscape positions and they don't have to be the same. So if you're a visual artist, photo editor, gamer, streamer, composer, stock trader, or if you just want an elite movie setup, all variations of display requirements are possible here. All right, so depending on the weight and size of your monitors, you'll have to use the tools provided to counterbalance the weight using the gas spring adjustment. The arms are adjusted by Huanua's secure gas spring mechanism. To adjust the tension in your monitor, you'll simply come over here, use the tool, and you'll turn clockwise to reduce gas spring tension for lighter monitors and turn counterclockwise to increase tension for heavier monitors. And once you find the right balance, the monitors will remain level in place. If you don't balance it right, the monitor might swing upward or downward. So you will indeed have to spend a few minutes finding that perfect balance, and you definitely wanna spend the necessary time possible for that. Uh, also included is, are the cable management chassis. I don't know if you can see that from here, right here. The cable management chassis, this is awesome. All right, these arms attached here, keep your cables, right? Keep your cables neat and organized so you can say goodbye to messy and tangly wires. I, I think they've really thought of everything. So when it's all said and done, you're going to have a perfectly balanced dual monitor system, right? That's easy to adjust to different programming needs. And that's basically it, eggheads. With this dual arm monitor stand, achieve perfect harmony with your displays. All right, twist and turn between landscape and portrait, right? You can stack them on top of each other even. Enjoy a tangle-free open space desk. Again, just so long as your desk is not glass or particle board and your monitors have VESA mounting patterns of 75 by 75 millimeter or 100 by 100 millimeter and between 4.4 or 14.3 pounds. <laughs> they do not have to be the same weight or size, by the way. Okay, your monitors don't have to be exactly the same. Mine here are, but yours do not have to be. Uh, they just have to be between 4.4 to 14.3 pounds and 13 to 27 inches. I love products that make workstations more accessible and manageable and sleek. This one gets five stars from me. Let us know what you think in the comments and reviews. For specific prices, please check the description or click that link below. The Huanua Dual Arm Monitor Stand. My dear eggheads, this has been New Egg Now, and now you know.